Uh, yes, indeed. Hello. What's going on? The infamous Luminary Sounds is in the building on a special day. Okay, yes, yes. Yes, that's right. With your boy Junior Leto, Francois the Great, and Missy Talks. Hey, let's get into it. Let's okay. go. Let's get it. You go guys, ahead, there are so many topics going out right now. I have literally have a whole list full. You guys know in my notebook. Anyway, so first thing I want to talk about is Fat Joe and these sneakers that he just bought, you guys. So um, recently, Donald Trump came out with golden high top three ninety nine sneakers, um, and Fat Joe went on. I want them. Wow. Well, okay. So Fat Joe recently went online um, saying he bought the sneakers um, only because he's a sneakerhead and he no way endorses Trump. So, I mean, what are your guys' thoughts? Are you buying them? Are you mad that he bought them? I'm not mad at Fat Joe for buying the sneakers. I think it's a collector's item, and I would have bought the sneakers. Fat Joe is a sneakerhead. I do know that about his collection. His collection is me. He has thousands of shoes. He is. Him and Wale both, man. Shout out to them both. So, if you are strong against um, Trump and you have the sneakers, are you wearing the sneakers? Well, what's the difference? Okay. What's the difference between when Kanye was wearing the Trump hat and then Fat someone's Joe's wearing the sneakers? sneakers. I, think I, I, think it's a, I think it's a huge difference. Hmm. Okay. Because the sneakers could be looked at like a little swag type thing, you know? They're golden. They don't say make America great again, which could be oh, okay. politically sure. incorrect for certain people. Because like for people, certain people of color, or all people of color, when was it great in this country? Right? Yeah, and a lot of people are saying, there's a lot of people out there saying he's using uh, this to get swag points with the urban community. He, a lot of oh, that was, um, that was on Fox News. Uh, so, so you know, it's, it's, it's very, very, very interesting. And, you know... <laughs> Trump is just hilarious, man. Did that hurt your feelings when it was like, well, the sneakers are trying to bring in the black people? Did that hurt your feelings? No, I mean, they're they're always going to try to bring in, you know, the, you know, urban community because we pretty much are the majority of this country. Uh, So it would be wise of whoever is trying (laughs) to pretty much run a nation to look at the population and go, I need to bring X amount of people in. And who are who are X amount of people? Who are these people? It's the black and the brown. That's I true. mean, that's no true. disrespect to my, you know, my white brothers and sisters, but that's what we got going on in this country. Well, they're what? comparing okay. it. They're comparing it to when uh, Hillary Clinton was on the campaign trail, and she was talking about how she has hot sauce in her bag. That, <laughs> that was no, you know Hillary ain't got no hot sauce in no bag. Come on, man. Oh, so they're kind man. of comparing it to that, honestly. Now wait, mm. what if she had tapatia in the bag? Mm. Are you? Are you? Are you like? I'm a you very, got my vote, Hillary. Uh, oh, does she have my vote because she has hot sauce in her no, bag? Tapatia. No, tapatia. No, I'm a Tabasco gal. Okay. I'm a Tabasco. Oh, Tabasco. Okay. okay. <laughs> you a Tapatio? I'm a Crystal's kind of guy. Oh, Crystal's, Crystal's hot sauce? Yeah, I'm a oh. Crystal's kind of guy. See, you I don't know, know about that, that one yet. So That's that Louisiana boy. Uh, am oh, I gonna there see we these, go. Am I going to see these sneakers in, sneakers in your collection, Junior? No, honestly, if I had them, I would have I worn them today. Oh, okay. I would have worn them today. I would have no problem saying I'm not voting for you, but I like the sneakers. There you go. Okay. Seriously, what's wrong? It's just sneakers. There you go. How much were they? 400 I think so. They're three, yeah, four hundred. But people are reselling them for like nine thousand dollars. I'm sure. I mean, people are making money off of that. I'm sure because what he is he only selling a certain amount and then he's gonna stop, or is he just gonna no continue? No hey, they say he's trying to pay for you know get out that jail, out of get out of jail pack. <laughs> Man, I know he has like he has some cases coming up. I want to say <laughs> some. Or, yeah, some. I mean, <laughs> the rest of them, I don't know what's happening. But he got some. Yeah, he got some cases coming up. So, so I don't know. I'm mis- I don't know. Uh, obviously, it's an interesting situation. So you you actually agree with Fat Joe and Fat Joe saying, "Hey, course, I, I got my sneaker collection. Hey, man. This will be one of those like five years from now, I pull them out the closet and be like, yo, the gold trumps.'" So, it, it, well, regardless of how you think about it, it's still a president of the United States, and it's part of like that history, right? A mm-hmm. hundred years from now, you've got the Trump sneakers. Nobody's gonna be caring about the political environment of what it was. It's like, bro, you got those sneakers from a hundred years ago. Mm. That's big. In my opinion. Gotcha. I would say um, if you're a true sneakerhead, how could you not get those shoes? Exactly. I, I will say exactly. that. I will say that. So. Joseph, would you get the sneakers? Joseph, oh, he ain't getting the sneakers. Going, Joseph going, is again the sneakers. He's he voting by it. I mean, there are people who, who won't do it. There just are mm. people who are like, yeah. nah, I'm not trying to. Mm. I don't even want to look like I'm supporting him or endorsing him this or is anything true. like that. This is mm. very, this is very, very true, very true, very true. Well, yeah. we're going to take a song break because we got some special guests in the building. We're going to have them up. This is a sister's new song, Saturn. We'll be right back. Let's go.